Hey guys, Buck 59 here coming to you with a birthday haul. As you guys know, today is March 1st, 2013, and it's my birthday. So yeah, I got myself this bad boy. Couldn't find them in stores, so I ordered it online. And uh well yeah, I mean <laughs> this is a neat packaging it comes in too. This is the Movie Masters uh Dark Knight trilogy. Toy Story exclusive three pack. Three pack because it comes with all three figures. Uh Batman from Batman Begins, Batman from Dark Knight. He has a new face sculpt on him, you'll see that later. And Batman from Dark Knight Rises, which is the repackaging of the other Batman that comes with the Bane. But with the Christian Bale head and the broken cow, which is neat. And then this one comes with a cloth cape, so that's new. And then it also comes with other different accessories, as I'll show you later on. But yeah, this is the box. As you can tell, it's it's nice and triangular shape. Well, not triangular shape, but it's a weird, kind of strange shape. Over here in the back, it gives you a bio of each character. From the Dark Knight movie, uh, the Batman movies, you can see here. You can pause it and read that if you want. Oh hell, it's my birthday, I'll read for you. After witnessing his parents' murder, Bruce Wayne pursued a path for vengeance. Eventually training with the mysterious Ra's al Ghul returning to Gotham City, he assumed the identity of Batman to fight crime and corruption. He soon faced his first major battle with the devious Dr. Jonathan Crane and the return of his former mentor Ra's al Ghul. With that, the story of Batman begins. And then here's the other one with the uh, Joker... And the Bane one. So yeah. Apparently each one comes with their own uh, stand. And a cool little poster. Of each movie. So that's cool. So yeah I can't wait. I'm excited. I've waited long enough for this day as it is. So let's open up these bad boys. And see how cool they really are. Alright so here we have the Batman figures opened up. And out of their packaging. And it's in... Uh, First of all, let me just show you this. Each one comes in a cool little gold envelope, which gives you the little poster that, you know, coincides with each one. This is where Batman Begins. And this one says Dark Knights, and has a poster for Dark Knights. This one says Dark Knight Rises. And each one comes with an individual poster. This is the one for the Dark Knight Rises. It's very nice. You got a nice little kind of a sticker thing over it. Because it's kind of trans translucent, see? It's pretty neat. I mean, it's got a nice feel to it, and you just place it onto the stand, like so. And here's the one that comes with the Dark Knight. It's neat, see? Welcome to World Without Rules. And the back, of course, and the translucent. I mean, these are pretty neat. I was uh, pretty excited to receive these when I saw the. The news of them at first. Here's the one for Batman Begins. It's nice, the bats. And see again, it's translucent. So, and again, each one comes with their own little stand. So, as you can tell, each one comes with you know their own stand. It says the name of their movie in Batman Begins. The other one says Dark Knight. The other one says Dark Knight Rises. Um, nothing new about the, the sculpt of the Batman Begins one. Pretty much the same as the other one figure. Joints are a little stiff. So, you know, be careful when trying to bend the joints. Um, only on the Batman Begins one, because apparently it's, you know, it's been remolded or something like that, because... Uh, the cape's still kind of a hard plastic. It's still a malleable plastic, because you can still bend the, sh you know, shapes in different sorts. Um, and standard articulations, the other ones, you know, just arms going in and out, forward and back, swivel at the wrist, bends one point in the elbow. The abdomen's still a little tough to, you know, get the, uh, pardon the noise, there's construction inside. You know, the legs still go in and out, so forward and back, it's got the T-joint right there. It's got a point right there in the knee, it's got a cut right there in the waist. Um, so yeah, that Batman figure is pretty much the same as the other ones, as the only one we've gotten. This one's new. Well, not so much new as, uh, you know, they gave us the cloth cape now for the, 
the Dark Knight Batman. Oh, and he's got a new facial feature too. He's got a new. He's got an angry looking face to him, as opposed to the other figure that um, you know, had a smile like that one. Let's put a smile on that face. So yeah, you can see the same articulation also as the other ones, if not a little bit better. And the uh, gauntlets are molded together, as opposed to the other ones, the ones that I have, the original one from the Dark Knight. When they were like, they're kind of like split apart a little bit. But yeah, this is neat. Comes with the cloth cape. So now, now we have two Batmans that come with the cloth cape. So that's this one. And then there's this one. And again, you know, I thought this was just like, oh, they just brought a, it just brought a Christian Bale head. But the Christian Bale has got colors on it too. It's got some white in the hair. On the sides here, see, to indicate the old Bruce Wayne. He's got more brown in the hair. Same Christian Bill face, though, as the other figures that originally I had reviewed already. And, you know, it's got the dirty Batman suit. You know, with the bronze. And uh, this one has hard plastic, as opposed to the other one that came with the Bane 2-pack. It comes with the cloth cape. So as you can tell. So yeah, these are the three Batman figures that it comes with. And of course it comes with the... Well, this one comes holding the broken cowl. And you see it's neat. And it's like... It's a rubbery material. And you know, if you have the Batman Bane 2-pack, you can have the Bane holding the... The broken cowl. Just like in the movie. So yeah. That was a birthday haul of the day. Pretty neat. I mean, neat packaging, cool little gold uh, envelopes, you know, to steal away the uh, the posters inside. Three individual posters for all figures. The stand, you know, and the figures themselves. I mean, the figures themselves are not that bad. I mean, at first I thought it was going to be, you know, bad. It's going to be, you know, they weren't going to have as much articulation. I mean, standard articulation as the other ones, though. Same thing. And... You know, the only thing new about it is the facial expression on this guy and the head sculpt on this guy. And of course, this one comes with a cloth cape now, so that's, you know, if only we can have this guy with cloth cape, that would be awesome. I mean, honestly, I would love for them all to come with a cloth cape variant because, you know, the the cloth cape gives it more, I mean, you can, you know, do different poses with it too and, you know, more for playing, I guess, not so much for posing. But again, you know, the, the posters are a really nice touch, just... Amazing, you know, these are gonna look amazing in my display case with the stands in each one. Best birthday gift ever. So, yeah, stay tuned for more reviews, guys. Uh, like this video if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you already haven't. And, you know, more figure reviews coming soon. Hopefully, in a few weeks from now, because those Prometheus Series 2 figures are already shipping, and uh, Predator Series 8 is already shipping. Very excited about that. We get Dutch. And yeah, that's pretty much it. So, until next time, guys. Thanks for watching.